Hello, my dear students. I am Gayatri, your English teacher. And today we are going to learn something very, very important. Can you guess what it is? Yes, we are going to learn about sentences. Do you speak in sentences every day? Of course you do. So, let's learn what they really are and the different types of sentences. Are you all ready? Let's begin. In the park. In the park. Very tired. They have meaning, but they do not make complete sentences. So what is a sentence? See, a sentence is a group of words that expresses a complete thought. Clear? So what is a sentence? A sentence is a group of words that expresses a complete thought and it always starts with the capital letter and ends with full stop, question mark or exclamation mark. Right? So what is a sentence? A sentence is a group of words. Here also we have group of words but they do not make complete sentence. So what is a sentence? It's a group of words that expresses a complete thought. Clear? Let's see some example. I like to read books. The dog is barking. Can you help me? What a beautiful day. Please sit down. So a sentence start with the capital letter, ends with the full stop, question mark or exclamation mark and also it must have subject and verb and it makes complete sense. Clear? Is it clear? Yes. Now see the praise. What is a praise? Here a praise is a group of words that does not expresses a complete thought but sentence it makes complete thought but praise group of words but that does not expresses a complete thought. Is it clear? For example, in the morning, a big tree with a smile on the table very fast. Here, group of words is there, group of words are there, but does not expresses a complete thought. But sentence, it makes complete sense. Clear? Hope you all understand. Now, now let's see the types of sentences. We have four types of sentences. What are they? First one is declarative. Second one is interrogative. Third one is imperative. And fourth one is exclamatory. So we have four types of sentences. That is declarative, interrogative, imperative and exclamatory. Now see the types of sentence. First one is declarative sentence. What is a declarative sentence? And how can we identify a declarative sentence? Now see. A declarative sentence states a fact or opinion. Declarative sentence states a fact or opinion and it ends with full stop. Now see the examples. She is a teacher. It states a fact. The sun rises in the east. This is also states a fact. And I love ice cream. It is opinion, right? And we are going to the park and it's raining today. So these are example of declarative sentence. So how can we identify declarative sentence means declarative sentence states a fact or opinion and it ends with the full stop, right? Now see the second one, interrogative sentence. 
it's very easy part interrogative sentence we can easily identify interrogative sentence so what is an interrogative sentence an interrogative sentence asks a question an interrogative sentence asks a question and it's end with question mark it's end with question mark so we can easily identify interrogative sentence interrogative sentence asks a question and it ends with it ends with a question mark clear for example what's your name it's a question right are you coming today do you like mangoes where do you live can i borrow your pencil so interrogative sentence ends with question mark and it asks a question clear so next one imperative sentence what is a imperative sentence and how can you identify imperative sentence let's see an imperative sentence gives a command or request an imperative sentence gives a command or request and it ends with the period or exclamation mark it means it ends with the full stop or exclamation mark and imperative sentence gives a command or request let's see some examples please close the door sit down don't touch that bring me a glass of water read the book carefully so these sentences give these sentence see these sentences are shows gives a command or request so how can we identify imperative sentence imperative sentence gives a command or request is it clear and also it ends with the full stop or exclamation mark right now see the final last one exclamatory sentence this is also very easy one exclamatory sentence expresses strong emotion an exclamatory sentence expresses strong emotion and it ends with an exclamation mark and one more thing already we saw that imperative sentence also ends with exclamation mark but it gives a command or request here exclamatory sentence also ends with exclamation mark but it shows strong emotion clear for example what a surprise how beautiful the garden is i won the prize oh no i forget my homework that was amazing so these sentences show strong emotion so what is an exclamatory sentence how can we identify exclamatory sentence means an exclamatory sentence expresses strong emotion and ends with exclamation mark clear hope you all got it let's review what we have learned today so what is a sentence a sentence is a group of words and it makes complete thought clear and what is a phrase a phrase is a part of a sentence without a complete thought and how many types of sentences we have four types of sentences what are they declarative interrogative imperative and exclamatory hope you all understood right so now here is your homework write one example of each type of sentence and write it in the comments below clear hope you all understood right So see you in the next video see you bye bye